the Pathfinder from 13 Fishing. I was lucky enough to get one of these early. Hey, this is Jacob from Jacob Tooth Tackle. Let's head to the lake, give this a product test review. We'll see you out there. <laughs> This one I'm really excited for. It is the Pathfinder. It is basically a weedless frog and pencil bait all in one. Like I said, I, I, I like fishing frogs, except I like pencils better, but when there's weeds, you can't really fish them. So they combine the two. Uh, let's get some specs on that too. Like I, said, I don't really know. I just got these in, excited to do a video. It is three quarter ounce weight, four and a quarter inches long, and uh, number three ring. I don't even know what that means floating, weedless, super excited to try. This has got to be the stunner color, I do know that. There we go. Got the first fish on the Pathfinder. It's gonna be not that easy to catch them because like I said, this is more of a test lake for me. And they're not real big. A little dink. I mean, the hooks are sharp. It's got good action. You can pop it like a frog. You can walk it like a pencil. Uh, you can brain baby bass. Sorry, dude. Let's see if I can get you out alive. <sighs> and you can reset this each and every time. Let's give another cast or two. So far, I don't know. I might try it on a different lake later. It's clouding up. My goal today was just to get these fished and with thunderstorms and 90 degree heat, that really makes a tough bite unless you go to a, like a dink lake like this where they're just jumping like crazy. All right guys, final thoughts on the 13 Pathfinder. It is half hard body, Got the rattle, half soft body, makes it weedless. I think it's a better hookup ratio, especially if you turn these hooks out a little bit than a, a plastic or a soft body frog. You can pop it like a frog, you can work it like a pencil. It doesn't excel at either. And the other portion is every cast sometimes you're gonna have to reset these hooks to make it weedless. And the other portion is it really comes off the body easily. And this turns even after two dinky bass. The hook would seat a little better. There's a bung here. You can see that hole. And there's a little knob on the hook. If you can see it, focus on the camera. There's a little knob right here. For the life of me, I can't get it back in there. It would help that seat and set nicely, but you do a cast, a little bit of, you know, it'll hang down. I really, really want to like this mate more than I did. Um, Honestly, this isn't going to replace my frog or a walking pencil. Cast like it's a cast a mile. It is weedless. And the only problem I have is this jointed mess of conglomeration that just doesn't want to stay together for me. Great idea. Might fish this once or twice more, but so close. So close to being a great product. Going to leave it there. See you next time. Fishing, whatever. Bye.